Okay, just a quick overview of my build to date, my 5x10 CNC plasma table. And uh, have my gantry finished today. Gantry is built out of 8020 extrusion material. They run a, an eBay store. You can go 8020.net or you could look them up on eBay. Uh, these are all remnants. You can get them for a very reasonable price. Uh, with, with the uh, PCB linear IVT rail and my K2 um, Z axis, uh, this gantry will have ended up costing me less than uh, $800 to build. So, uh, a very good product for a very decent price. Check them out online. I got my uh, rails all put together. I got my bearings mounted and aligned. Did all my finished welding today. Anchored to the floor in the concrete. And uh, my top rails, as uh, you may have seen online, two by four, quarter inch wall. Drilled and tapped every six inches on the rail. Drilled and tapped every six inches on the V-groove. This thing is solid. Could drive a truck up on this. Uh, have no problems with any material that, that I could put on here. Uh, could drop a 5 by 10 inch on this thing and, and I don't think it would budge. So, uh, tend to overbuild. And uh, you can see kind of bouncing back and forth between uh, a half a degree and level. So, uh, I may tweak around with that a little bit later. Uh, tomorrow, I'll be working on my mount for the for my Z and uh, drilling out for my bearings on that. And uh, it's coming along pretty good. Uh, you can see my adjustment system for my rails. Just a bunch of lock nuts and 7 8 inch all thread. A lot of drilling there, a lot of heavy drilling in that quarter inch. Uh, but I can loosen up the lock nuts dial this uh, rails in side to side in front to back in a matter of minutes to perfectly flat. Uh, here you can see pretty much how I did my mounting system for the gantry. That's 5 8 inch 24 uh, all thread going through a 1 inch block that's been slotted out for the V-groove bearing to fit into and then it goes up inside uh, to another lock nut and, and uh, steel plate and I could adjust the gantry up or down, left to right, and uh, keep it dialed in. So that's pretty much it. Um, gantry rides really smooth. Let's just give it a little push here. And uh, as you can see, even down at the end there, uh, it's so accurate, it was bouncing a little bit there, but there you go, perfectly flat. Um, may not even mess with it, it's so close. So that's my build to date. Uh, my next project tomorrow, as I said, will be to put together a mounting plate for my Z and uh, start working on the uh, templates for the motor mounts. I have to mount the racks underneath the edge of the angle iron there and uh, come up with my mounting plates for the motors and steppers and everything. So. Still a long ways to go, but uh, I'd say the heavy-duty uh, fabrication is pretty much complete. I'm going to template out my motor mounts and uh, cut them freehand with the, with the plasma. And then once I get the table up and running, if I feel like uh, making something really, really pretty, then you know I'll cut it out uh, on the table after it's up and running. So that's a, just a quick overview of the build to date. And um, getting excited. It's starting to look like something. Till next time.